In this equation, we have NaHCO3 decomposing into sodium carbonate, water, and carbon dioxide. Let's count the atoms up on each side. So on the reactant side, we have sodium, one of those, hydrogen, one, carbon, one, and then oxygens, we have three of those. On the product side, we have two sodiums, two hydrogens, one carbon, plus this carbon over here, so that gives us two of those. Oxygens, we have three plus one plus two, so we have six oxygens. Let's fix the sodiums first. We'll put a two in front of the NaHCO3, one times two. So that balances the sodiums, hydrogens, one times two. That'll balance those two, which is nice. And then for carbon, one times two, that equals two. So those are balanced. And finally, three times two for the oxygens. And that's balanced. And we're done. This equation is balanced. If you had problems, it may have been counting that we have one, two carbons, or perhaps the three plus the one plus the two. You have to make sure you count all of the oxygen atoms. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for NaHCO3 breaking apart into Na2CO3 plus H2O plus CO2. Thanks for watching.